announcements and news. Last week, grade 7 and grade 9 students went down to lower school to interview grade 2 and grade 3 students for their respective design ideas. Grade 7s are making stop motion videos and grade 9s are making games from scratch. They're trying to get an understanding of what their client wants in their videos and games. Last week, we were visited by a variety of universities. Hopefully, a lot of you were able to attend. Students in grades 10 to 12 can join this group to learn more about university-related events on campus and around Doha. On Thursday last week, the whole school celebrated International Peace Day by wearing white. Thank you to all the members of our community who participated. Team sports have officially kicked off. Good luck and good job to all those who have joined our swimming and volleyball teams. Go Wolves! Hi, my name is Mohammed, and thanks for listening to Game of the Week. This week's game is Kirby and the Forgotten Land, which came out less than a year ago. In the game, you, you play as Kirby, who has been teleported from Dreamland to, the, to a beautiful city, where you have to save the Waddle Dees from the Ferocious Beast game. This game is for Nintendo Switch. Hi guys, and welcome to Fun Facts. Today's fun facts are about World Peace Day. The International Day of Peace is recognized by 79 countries around the world. The UN encourages a 24-hour ceasefire and places experiencing war on this day. The first International Peace Conference occurred in Paris in 1949, and it used Pablo Picasso's Dove of Peace as its emblem. And since then, people have known the dove as the most recognizable symbol of peace. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you had an amazing World Peace Day. Welcome to Jokes Week with Alia Daphne. Why was Cinderella so bad at football? She kept running away from the ball. What did the horse say after it tripped? Help, I've fallen and I can't giddy up. What would bears be without bees? Ears. That's all I have for you today, and I hope you have a great week. Thank you for watching our first broadcast of the year. Please join us each week for your weekly news and updates. If you have an idea for any news stories or updates to share, please email us at goodmorningacs at gmail.com. Have a great week.